Language builds bridges and erases cultural misunderstandings. For seven decades, diplomats, scholars, artists, and entrepreneurs have learned to speak the language of other countries and cultures at a university that has grown from the caves of Yan'an into a prominent national institution. Beijing Foreign Studies University was born during a time of war. It opened in 1941 in Yan'an, China's famous revolutionary base, as the Russian language section of a military and political college. It soon became Yan'an Foreign Languages School and played its part in the war under the direction of Mao Zedong, Zhou Enlai, and other revolutionary leaders. With the founding of the People's Republic of China, the school began expanding its foreign language program beyond Russian and English to the more than four dozen languages now taught at Beijing Foreign Studies University. It worked to develop a unique language education system and enhance its status as a key national university with language teaching and learning as its core. Other fields like area studies, diplomacy, law, business studies and journalism were coordinated in a cross-disciplinary ethos. From the beginning, textbooks produced by the university promoted the development of foreign language education throughout China. The broad reach of these textbooks was made possible with the support of the Foreign Language Teaching and Research Press, which is the third largest publisher in China. As a premier institute of higher learning, BFSU attracts and nurtures the best minds of each generation. Academic masters like Wang Zolian, Xu Guozhang, Zhou Juliang, and Na Zhang, as well as international friends like David and Isabel Crook and Elisabetta Kishkina have all taught here, instructing over 80,000 graduates. Among them, more than 400 went on to become Chinese ambassadors. BFSU teaches 49 foreign languages, including all 23 official languages of the European Union and 10 official languages of ASEAN. 20 of these languages are taught nowhere else in China. The BFSU Graduate School of Translation and Interpreting and its forerunner, the UN Translators Training Program, established in 1979, have trained most of China's interpreters to the United Nations. BFSU's cross-disciplinary approach is supported by the strategy of internationalization in educational development. It is now engaged in cooperation projects with 380 universities and organizations from 70 countries and regions. Each year, it welcomes nearly 2,000 international students and employs 200 international experts. This helps foster understanding and empathy among students for individual cultures and is a reflection of the university's overriding commitment to harmony without uniformity. One of BFSU's proudest statistics is its graduate employment rate, one of the highest in China. In 2011, BFSU won the national prize for university graduate employment. A keystone of a university is its research. BFSU is home to major research institutes, such as the National Research Center for Foreign Language Education, the National Research Center for Overseas Sinology, and the Beijing Center for Japanese Studies. One example of their work is the Dynamic Database of Overseas Chinese Studies, which is specially supported by the National Social Science Foundation. Prestigious scholars from home and abroad regularly gather at BFSU for international academic conferences. BFSU publishes both academic journals with international recognition and popular periodicals which cater to the needs of foreign language learners all over China. BFSU's programs are offered beyond its campus. Teacher training and teacher assistance to help improve foreign language instruction are provided to elementary schools in remote and impoverished areas of China. 
In 2010, this outreach program won the UNESCO AP Award for Educational Innovation. Cooperative projects are conducted with many organizations, such as China Daily and China International Publishing Group. High quality language services are provided to international events such as the Beijing 2008 Olympic Games and the Shanghai World Expo by the Beijing Multilingual Service Center created to promote Beijing as an international capital. In line with the policy of introducing China to the world and as part of the strategy of globalizing Chinese culture, BFSU has established 18 Confucius Institutes around the world and is building a multilingual base for the promotion of the Chinese language. In 2010, it established the first center for public diplomacy studies in China. Each year, BFSU teachers and students visit other countries for cultural exchange, language study, and research. Distinguished and influential scholars, artists, and politicians are invited to the university to exchange ideas. BFSU has conferred honorary doctoral degrees on significant international figures, including Sultan Hassanal Bolkia of Brunei, Russian Deputy Prime Minister Alexander Zukov, the Prime Minister of Malaysia Najib Razak, and the Sri Lankan President Mahinda Rajapaksa. The cultural life of BFSU's campus is enriched by its students through their festivals and performances. Their talent and individual cultures produce a unique and distinct campus. In 2011, the BFSU Institute of Arts opened to help enhance the promotion of Chinese culture internationally. In this 70th anniversary year, BFSU can look back with pride on its many achievements and its rich heritage of academic attainment. More importantly, it can look forward to an even brighter future as it expands its language program to satisfy the needs of global communication. The students of today will take their place in the world as tomorrow's leaders confident in their knowledge and abilities to talk to the world.